In this video, I'll show you how to transfer data from one Android device to another Android device. Here I have the Samsung Galaxy S23 Ultra as the old phone, old Android phone, and the Sony Xperia 1 Mark V as the new Android phone. Before using the Sony Xperia 1 Mark V, I did a reset on it, a full factory reset, so it's like new, it shows the menus to set it up. And I start with the Sony Xperia phone, make sure the battery is charged on both phones, because you will not be able to charge them while doing this, you need to connect the cable from one phone to another. And I can start the process, I choose the language and I choose get started. This might be a little bit different on each device, on each Android phone, this might be slightly different, but not by much. You have to accept some things. The second check mark here, I'm not sure if I really need to accept it, but it continues. Now, the important thing is that you need to connect to the Wi Fi. I'm doing the transfer through the USB cable, so that might not be really necessary, but I'm going to set up the Wi Fi anyway. First, to check, check the Wi Fi, open the old phone and see where you are connected to the Wi Fi, and then you have the option to, on the settings, to share, to show the QR code. So I have the option to show the QR code there. Once I show the QR code from the old phone, I go to the new phone, to the new Android phone, and I add network, and then I tap on this QR code sign there, and then you scan the QR code. I will not show the QR code right now, but you will scan the QR code and it will automatically connect to the Wi-Fi. You see, it's already connected. When scanning the QR code, the QR code has to be in that picture, the little window of the camera. I agreed only to the necessary checkboxes, and I continue with the next step. Now, this is the important part, copy apps and data. You can skip this, you can set it up as a new device, but I have the old Android phone here next to me, and it's working, and I would like to copy data from it, so it's easier to set up the new Android phone. You can set it up as a new phone, but it's much easier like this. So I press next, and then I choose use another device, 